Hey there, it's Brian with Old Man New Tech, and I've got a little confession. I've got a problem when it comes to Bluetooth speakers. I love the things, man. I collect them. I've got tons of Bluetooth speakers lying around the house. I have the hardest time letting them go. Now, as you know, I review a lot of Bluetooth speakers on this channel. So, imagine my surprise when I found out that a company, a reputable company, that sells quality Bluetooth speakers was having a sale on Amazon. I got this cool speaker from Tribit. Now, if you remember, I reviewed the Tribit Stormbox Micros, and I loved those speakers. They were portable, they were tiny, and I was able to pair them together for stereo or party mode. And they had a cool little strap on the back, which meant that I could attach them to just about anything that I wanted to attach them to. Now, Tribit has stepped up with the Tribit X Sound Surf. And as I mentioned before, shh, they sell these things at a really cheap steal of a price. So if you get a chance, go down below, check out the pricing, and if you can get it for you know around 15 to 20 bucks, buy them because they'll sell out quick. So if you do want to check out the pricing down below and you want to show the channel a little bit of love, give me a thumbs up, shoot me a couple comments, let me know what you think about the Tribit X Sound Surf, and maybe ring that little bell so you get notified every time I have a new video come out. So full disclosure, sometimes companies send me products like this and then also sometimes I just buy them and like to review them. These were such a great deal that I bought two of them and we're gonna do another follow-up video to this to show you how to pair two of them and then also give you a review on how they sound once they're paired. And you know when I buy a speaker like this, I usually get two because I love true wireless stereo with these speakers. But hey, I'm rambling on here. Let's see what's in the box. Brilliant! Brilliant! All right, so we're taking a look at the Tribit X Sound Surf and pretty typical boxing for a Tribit product. They got the orange Tribit logo and white background, picture of the product in the front. And as we can see some of the deets on here, we got the IPX7 waterproof, Bluetooth 5.0, long battery life. Oh, superior sound, let's not forget that. And then stereo party mode, which we are going to explore on a later video. So keep your heads up for that. But hey, you know what? I don't like doing really long, drawn out unboxing videos, so let's unbox this magic style. All right, and we got everything unboxed here. Let's take a look. We got our USB-C charging cable, which again, I'm not really reviewing any products that don't have USB-C anymore because as far as I'm concerned, that is the industry standard now. And they had a nice little compartment over here where they stuck the USB-C cable so they didn't just throw it in the box. And then we have our user manual compartment and we've got our user manuals here. But you know what, I'm only gonna crack this open when I wanna pair this speaker up with another one. So I'm really not looking at that one right now. They offer a 30 day money back guarantee and an 18 month warranty. So they do stand behind their products. Finally, we have the speaker itself. And if you can kind of look into the light there, you can see where I have two drivers and then I've got a passive radiator right here in the middle. It's got a mesh metal front and you can see the tri-bit logo is painted on here but it's very subtle and classy i also like the fact that this is a rubberized material on the exterior i've got real simple easy to use controls i've got power bluetooth function play pause and then also my down and up controls for the volume around the side here you're going to find your charging port and your auxiliary in but you know the more waterproof these things are the harder they are to open so we got a nice sturdy case there with a little flappy hinge and then we've got our 3.5 millimeter input jack as well as our USB-C charging port. And on the bottom we've got a couple rubber pegs. You're going to want these because this sets flat on a table. You'll notice that it doesn't really have any sort of way of like hanging it up. There's nothing built into the case for putting like a carabiner or a strap so that you can hang it up. But that's everything you get in the box. Now let's go pair this up and see how it sounds. Okay, so pairing the X-Sound Surf is as easy as just hitting the power button. And we get that tone. And it's connected. Now let's see how it sounds. All right, so we're gonna play some royalty-free hip hop from Spotify so we don't get in trouble with the YouTube gods. feel it vibrating in my hand. Yeah. All right, let's pick it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. 
is about half volume right now. All right. You'll see that little blue light on there. I'll let you know we're connected. All right. <laughs> nice. All right, I'll let you guys get a little listen to that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so. All right, so we're going to lower that a little bit so I can have a conversation here. Because after all, it is not about listening to this device through your device. Um, I'm going to give you my impressions of what I'm hearing right now. And what I'm hearing is a boatload of bass coming out of this tiny little speaker. I mean, it's about as long as my, actually it's shorter than my hand. And so it's going to fit into any sort of case nicely if you're going to go on a trip or something. And if you wanted to stick it, I guess, in the drink holder of your bicycle, it can fit there too. But the sound itself is crisp, clear. I'm getting a lot of bass. The mid-range is nice. So the bass itself is impressive. I mean, for the size, you know, it's not gonna blow you away. Um, if you want real bass out of a Bluetooth speaker, there are bigger speakers out there, but for its size, it has the most bass that I've reviewed for a speaker like this, including Tribit's own Stormbox Micro. I'll probably end up doing a comparison review on that in an upcoming video. Because I tell you what, the price that this is coming in at is so much less than even that Stormbox Micro or a Bose Soundlink that you'd be a fool not to take a look at this. But again, that sound is impressive and we can get up to 100%. It really fills the room up. Okay, so we're gonna turn this down and we'll talk about the other features. So I do love the way the speaker sounds, but with Bluetooth 5.0, I can experience that sound up to 100 feet away from my music source. And around my house, I was able to get 70 feet away around corners and walls and such. Now waterproofing is also a cool part of this package. And of course I had to give it the true Pontiac Lake waterproofing test. All right, so apparently the private X-Sound Surf is completely waterproof, so IPX7, I can submerge it and let's see if it floats. All right, we have a floater as we call this in my business. And it doesn't turn off when you throw it in the drink. Check that out. <laughs> All right, cool. So yeah, it passed with flying colors. It's still working great. Now as far as the battery life goes, well, Tribit claims that it has a 10 hour battery life, but at the volumes that I play it at, usually I'm cranking them up almost to full volume, I'm getting about seven hours of usage out of it, which is not a problem because charging it takes less than two hours. So my final impressions, well, the Tribit X Sound Surf is one of the best valued speakers that I've found on this channel. But here's my pros and cons. Well, the pros, I mean, I love the sound, like I said before, it is waterproof and it does float. It's got great range and battery life and it is tough and durable and its size makes it very portable for trips. And all the cons, I only have really one con for this speaker, and that is the fact that it does not have a strap on it. And I also have no place to put a carabiner or uh, a loop that I could hang it on something so that if I wanted to hang it in the shower, I could hang it in the shower or hang it at a campsite. I'll have to find a flat surface to put it on. Or I guess I can wedge it somewhere. But that's my only criticism. I mean, the Tribit X Sound Surf is priced to move and it is a great value. It sounds great and you really can't go wrong. In fact, uh, at the price that I got it at, it was easy enough to order two. I got two for like under 30 bucks. No way! So if you're in the market for some micro speakers that are great for the outdoors, that are totally waterproof, you can't go wrong with the Tribit X Sound Surf. And that's why I'm giving it a big buy now while they last recommendation. Now, hey, get out there and have some fun. Hey, this is Brian with Old Man New Tech. We can't make this channel happen without you, so please hit subscribe and smash that bell down below. And if you're looking for product links, you'll find them there too. Thank you.